My plane crashed, and I'm stranded deep. I was on my way home from traveling Asia when the plane went down in the middle of the ocean. I'm the only survivor, and now I'm stuck on a life raft. Hopefully I can find land soon where I can rest and try to survive. Oh, man. Where am I? A paddle! My paddle! Paddle! Patty the paddle! Hello! And welcome, everyone, to Stranded Deep. Hopefully you've seen my first impressions of the game, and, uh, if not, I'll link that in the description. I'm Justin with Only SP, and, uh, welcome back to the Survival Diary series. Stranded Deep is a new survival game that just released on, uh, uh, the other day, January, January 23rd, on Steam, and it's actually a pretty neat, pretty neat survival game. I'm gonna do my best to see if I can stay alive pretty long. Uh, I haven't, I've been playing this game a good bit, and I haven't gotten to the point where I've actually died yet. Although, with all the sharks in the game, who knows what could, what could happen? Stranded Deep is basically uh, you're stranded in the Pacific Island after a plane crash. And so now I have to survive and figure out how to get home. Um, you start with on this first island. You can go to all sorts of different islands, which I'm not going to do just yet because you can get pretty lost pretty easily. But there's a lot of things on the island you can use to craft things that you need. Um, the game is pretty interesting because there's a limited HUD. They really don't want they really want you to get uh, immersed into the game as much as you can. But there's a potato plant. I'm gonna leave that potato plant for later. Um. And so they really want you to feel like uh, you're part of this, you know, with a limited HUD and stuff like that. Are there no... This is a really small island. This is a really small island. This island is hella small. So what I'm doing now is that you can collect rope and rocks and sticks from all around the island. Um, you can use that to make an axe and a hammer and stuff like that. And the hammer... Will, uh, the axe will be used to cut down trees, of course, and, the, and use on other things. And the hammer will eventually be used to build... Um, like a house and stuff like that. I think this is a good spot right here to make my base, basically. So, you see I have limited inventory. You start with a lighter, um, pocket knife, water, and the paddle. And, uh, I'm actually gonna, let me leave the paddle in here. Let me leave the paddle in. Oh, well that didn't work out, did it? Leave the paddle in the life raft. Thank you, thank you. And, uh, we're actually gonna just throw everything else on the ground. Um... It's all about, like, inventory management, basically. You want to keep things kind of organized. I'm actually, I can actually make a an axe real quick. And these rocks right here, they're very important. These rocks are a big deal. Islands only have limited rocks, so eventually I'm going to have to go to another island and get some rocks. And I want to look for a tree that has coconuts on it, because I can... That way I can stock up on coconuts. Here's a, here's a bunch of coconuts. And the coconuts, if you, uh, like I said, in my first impressions, I covered a lot about the game, a lot, uh, like how, how it works, how it plays, stuff like that, so make, make sure to see that. I probably won't be doing a lot of explaining in this, just sort of like, uh, just doing it, you know, just doing it. So we need these coconuts, because I can drink and eat these coconuts, and that can, uh, help both of our status bars that we have here. If you see on my watch, it is currently 946, uh, or... Oh, oh, it seems like the minutes are going by pretty fast. <laughs> and uh, if I click on my watch, it has my my uh, survivor gauges. This is my health, hunger, and thirst. And so we're pretty good right now. The uh, the coconuts are definitely going to help. So let's put the coconuts in like the coconut corner. This will be the coconut corner. Uh, coconut corner right here next to the boat. Right there. So let's cut up. I don't need my water. Actually, can I get water? Is there anything? Oh, I just, I just drank it. Okay. Oh, I, I drank it again. Stop drinking the water. Stop. Does it have what? Does it have like infinite water in it? I don't know. Can I? I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop messing with my water bottle because I haven't done a lot a lot of uh, messing around with the water bottle. I initially thought that the water bottle was empty, but as you can see, I just took two two uh, two nice swigs from it. <laughs> so uh, I'm gonna cut up these trees, and I can use these trees for wood. Obviously, put the wood over here, uh, and cut these logs up into a bunch of sticks, and then use the sticks to make stuff. We're gonna need a campfire. Uh, the night's gonna come soon. Luckily, the night's not too big a problem. There's no, there are no monsters or anything that come out at night. Just, just, uh, just sharks. And I'm gonna stay away from the water for now, so no need to worry about that. I'm gonna cut this up so I can make palm fronds. Palm fronds are gonna be useful to make a bed and stuff like that. 
chop 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 uh, but the, the one of the things I'm dreading right now is I'm, I'm gonna have to eventually travel to another island. Like that's that's a that's a for sure, um, because I'm gonna run out of resources I need on this island, like sticks and rocks and stuff. Um, specifically rocks. Rocks are gonna be very useful in, uh, down the road because I can use, make them make hammer, make more axes. Because this axe will run out eventually. I can make a hammer, make more axes, and I'm gonna need rocks. I'm gonna need a lot of rocks to make a fire pit, and. uh uh, I'm looking for rocks right now. Actually, I don't. I better. The, 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 I better find some more rocks on this island. This this island better have some more rocks. I'm gonna be upset if it doesn't. I can get those crabs once I make a spear. I'm not seeing a lot of rocks. I'm not. Not not a good sign. Not a good sign. And I'm see. I'm I'm timid to go to another island. Not only because of sharks and stuff like that. Because the the raft has a has a glitch in it where if you it'll it'll like disappear from underneath you when you're on it and then you'll just be stranded in the water and that's not good that's not good for anybody not good for anybody so I'm gonna chomp on these uh, 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 potatoes that sound like apples actually let me put the stick up real quick uh, lucky for me this island while it, while this island is small it has the shipwreck right here which might have some goodies in it if I can figure out how to get in it uh, shipwrecks and stuff like that what's that over there what is that What's this? What is this? Is this a piece of land? What is this? Uh, look, what is this? I think it is a piece of land. Uh, oh no, it's a ship? Oh no, oh, see, I was about to start talking about how ships have these uh, treasure chests right here and they have stuff in it. And that's a pocket knife right there. Pocket knife would definitely be useful um, when fighting sharks. <laughs> Let's see, this, this looks like a big ship, so there's gotta be something else I can find on here. Gotta be careful because you can get stuck right now. This game is in early access, so this, it's got a few problems. Um, you know, no, nothing they can't fix, I'm sure. But I've gotten stuck in a ship before. Ooh, duct tape? That's gonna be useful for something, I'm sure. Give me the duct tape, thank you. What else? Can I go in this hatch? I don't think I can. Let me make sure. There's no, like, oxygen level, so I don't know if I'm about to drown or not until it's too late, you know? Uh, I'm just looking around, because I wanna... F I wanna find some goodies. I want to have a good start since it seems like my island doesn't really have a lot of rocks on it. And rocks are very important. Very important. You'll see as soon as I start making a uh, as soon as I start making a uh, campfire and stuff like that. Can I, is there anything else I can I don't know if I can get into this oh here we go. Here's a, here's a part of the ship I completely missed. I can go in the cabin here, this top part. And there's got to be like a locker or something. Here we go. Cabinet with baked beans. Nice. Baked beans, baby. I love me some baked beans. Oh, I'm dying. Hang on. Oof. How's my, how's my health looking? My health is really low. I'll come back to this ship, actually. That's a good... I'm, I got a good spot. I got that ship and I got this ship right here, which I haven't even looked in yet. So let's uh, go ahead and make a campfire, at least. Um, so I can have that ready for the night. When the night runs comes around. Uh, where's my stuff? Where did I... I should probably put... I should probably move my stuff right there. But I like this. This spot's okay, I guess. I like this spot. So, let's get to... Let's chop up these wood. These woods. Uh, for a campfire, I'm going to need five sticks. So, I'm going to just chop up this log. Each log gives you four sticks. So, I'm going to... I'm pretty well off on sticks. Oh, God. My sticks exploded everywhere. So, I got my sticks here. Let's make a campfire. Boom. Let's put the campfire... Put the campfire right, like right here. That's a good spot for it, I think. Um, and actually, we're gonna need to add on to the campfire with rocks. I really not find any more rocks in my on my island. Got these baked beans though. That's good. Baked beans, baby. Duct tape. Duct tape can show right there. The water bottle can show right there. And everything else can stay in my inventory. Um, now these coconuts, I can actually mess with in a minute. How's my hunger? My hunger's not too bad. So, I want to... What do I want to do? I want to check this boat, actually, to be honest with you guys. Actually, I, pro I should probably... Ah, whatever. Let's check the boat. Let's see what's in the boat. And see if I can find anything cool. Cool. Can I Can I get, like, on top of the boat? Please? Maybe not. Maybe I can go through this hole that's down here. Can I go through this hole? I can... I cannot? No. Doesn't seem like I can. Oh, well. Can I actually get on the boat, though? Like, come on. Come on, game. Come on. Come on. I can't get on this boat. I'm having issues getting on the boat. I have an idea. I can probably bring the raft up to it and then do that. Raft, come with me. 
I have a task for us. Give me a paddle. Paddle. Alright, raft. I'm gonna use the raft as sort of a... Sort of a ladder, I guess. So the raft, just come with me. Just come with me. We're gonna go in the water. Let me get on you real quick. We're gonna go to the other side of the boat. Actually, I can probably do it from this side. I'm just gonna use the raft to jump onto the boat, basically. Boom! Easy peasy. Now, hopefully I can get out of here. Hopefully my raft doesn't go, in it, go away. Stay right there, Rafty. Rafty the raft. This game can uh, really get to you sometimes. I, I did a stream uh, the other day on our on our Twitch channel, which I'll link in the description if you're interested in watching the, the playback on it, um, where I just got lost, lo so lost, and because uh, I went from one island to another and I couldn't figure out how to get back to my original islands. So hopefully I won't have that issue. Hopefully I won't have that issue uh, this time around. I got some antibiotics. That's really good. A, f a flashlight. That's good. A bucket. Yes. The bucket's important because I can use the bucket to to make a uh, make a better water engine. Wow. I can use it. I got an engine. I don't know what the engines and there's an engine and fuel tank and stuff like that. I don't know what those are used for right now. But good to have. Good to have. Um, surely. Can I get on top? Is there anything on top? Probably not. Right. Can I, can I even climb? It doesn't seem like I can climb that ladder. Oh, well. Good finds, though. Good finds from both of these boats. That's definitely awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So, actually, I can pull my life raft right here. That's a good spot for it. Good spot for my life raft. Throw a paddle in there. Later, paddle. All right, so we got our fire. We got our stuff. We got our... Uh, this is going to be like the stash of stuff I don't need to use right now. Um, the flashlight would be useful down the road. These engines, I don't really know what to do with. Can I, Do they have a description? One of four parts to an engine, so I need four of those, okay? I need four of those. Or maybe there's different pieces that I need. So I got the duct tape. Can I use the duct tape for anything? I'm not sure. Duct tape. If you can't fix it with duct tape, you're not using enough. I don't know what the duct tape's used for right now, but something uh, cool to use. Now, the metal bucket, I can collect water with. Bucket of seawater. And maybe, I don't know, I don't know my chemistry very well. I don't know if you can make seawater drinkable. Uh, I can drink it though. That's probably not, that's probably not the healthiest. Uh, oh, yep, that didn't, that didn't help. My, my thirst just went down like a lot. That's what seawater does to you people. It makes you even thirstier. Isn't that ir ironic? It's pretty ironic. Uh, where's my, wait, bucket, bucket. The bucket can go on the ground right now. He can just chill right there with all my other stuff. All right. Oh yeah, antibiotics too. What do what do they do? I know morphine uh, heals broken limbs, and that can use that can treat poisoning. That's useful. You can get food poisoning if you don't cook your food. Like you saw, there's a bunch of crabs around. I'm, once I make a uh, upgraded campfire, I can actually I can probably just stick with that campfire. I can uh, cook some things, and then we'll be good to go on that. But I don't have any rocks. There's no rocks here. That sucks. Now there's no no rocks anywhere. I guess I can just uh, focus on collecting some stuff, make sure I'm stocked up real good. I'm gonna have to leave this island to go get rocks. I think that's the that's what that's what I'm gonna have to do. Um, where's that other yucca plant? Yucca plant? I saw you around somewhere. Is that you right there? That is you. Hey, yucca plant. Good to see you. This yucca plant and that potato plant I saw earlier, they're gonna grow back. So I have plenty of rope and plenty of potatoes. So that's good. And I got these coconuts, which are awesome. Do I do I need to go ahead and work on those? I do. Let's go and work on these coconuts. Get my axe out. Actually, I can use my combat knife. Wait, where'd that other combat knife go? Did I throw it down here somewhere? Oh, no. They stack. The combat... Okay, yeah. I forgot. They stack. So I got another combat knife on top of this one right here, which is really good. So I'm going to chop over these coconuts. Looks like it's about to come nighttime, which, uh, which will conclude my first day of survival. Well, not really. I'll, I guess the the nighttime will have to serve as the first day as well. So we're gonna cut open these coconuts and uh, go ahead and dig into them. Once you cut up the co cut open the coconuts from their shell, then you can uh, hit them again like that. And so now we have two drinkable coconuts. I'm actually gonna bring them over here, so you can drink them to get your thirst meter back up. So let's throw that. I drank that one, so now I'm done with that one. Let's drink this one. Done with that one. How's our meter looking? Our meter's looking great. So once you drink them, then you can cut them open. You just swing at it a little bit. Boom. I'll cut up this one too. Might as well eat them. We still have four more coconuts we haven't even touched, so that's pretty good. 
Now we got these coconut halves, which you can eat. Nice and easy, like, oh, there we go. Nom, and nom. Am I good there? Yeah, I can say I got two more that I can save. So, looks like the sun's going down, which con will conclude my first half a day out here on this island. Uh, it's like Castaway, basically. It's a Castaway simulator. Stranded Deep. So if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and comment. And uh, there's definitely more to this to come. Uh, it's about to be nighttime, and I gotta light this fire and get to work. So thanks for watching, guys. Till next time.